when I was a reporter in Los Angeles and I covered crime, my routine was, and there was murders every day, my routine was, first of all, there would be a process of deciding what murders we would write about. They would actually put a value on murders. Right. And what would be not written about, what would be a brief, what would be a full-blown story. And if it was something I would write about, I would take a file and create a file and put what I have in there, whether it be official documents. Inside the file, I would write the names of the detectives on the case, their numbers. The next day, I would cut the clip out of the newspaper. This was really before they were e-newspapers uh, e and so forth. And I would put it in the file, and then I would put it in my file cabinet so it would be ready to go as soon as they uh, solved that case or made an arrest. And then um, I reached a point where I could quit the job and just be a full-time writer, and I was clearing my stuff out, and I literally had hundreds of files of cases that were ready to go, but they never, they wow. never solved them. Yeah. And so it's kind of drilled into me as a journalist that people get away with murder, there are always loose ends, there are questions that even in solved cases people cannot answer about motivations, about pieces of evidence, how did that piece of, that little drop of blood get all the way on that wall, we'll never know. And so I think any kind of novel that, it, that hopes to reflect a real world has to have unanswered questions. You know, it, it's, but it's interesting because we're kind of in a, in a culture that really likes certainty. I mean, we hang on to that in a lot of different ways. And, and we like our, I think, stories often tied up in a neat little bow. Well, I think you're, we, you're want, cert that we want certainty. I don't know if we need the bow. I mean, yeah. I think there are certainties in my books. There's a certainty that when you're writing in a story with Harry Bosch that he's going to be relentless and he's going to find out who did this. That's, that's an absolute. And that's why we like him. That's why we want to ride with him. But he might not find out all the reasons why right. it happened, but he's going to find out what happened and who did it. Right. And, uh, you know, I think that's certainly enough. I don't think, you know, like that, the blood, the little drop on the wall, I don't think, uh, you know, somebody's world is going to collapse if I don't explain that, you know. <laughs> you know, I think they'll, they'll get, um, you know, readings about fulfillment and satisfaction. I think the books can, can have, any books, but mine in particular, can have that without, without all the answers.